All right, students, so let us take this particular problem. First of all, let's try to read. Okay, let me tell you one thing where have I picked this question from. So this question is from Gaokao examination. That's the Chinese examination, which is done at the pre-university level to select students for university examinations. And this was a 2019 question, which became very viral on the internet. So let's try and understand what this question is asking. The domain of fx is x belonging to r. And fx satisfies fx plus 1 is equal to 2 times fx. So this is a sort of functional equation, which we should make sure that we should understand that how to utilize this functional equation, right? This functional equation becomes important for us. Also understand f of x plus 1 is equal to 2fx. Let's, before even going further, if we have to do some sort of calculation and understanding here, f of x plus 1 is equal to 2 times fx. This is a very, very beautiful understanding which we can derive from here is that this will be Okay, what would have happened if there was f of x plus 1 is equal to fx? Then the, you will say that the function is periodic with period 1. But here, the problem is that it is twice. So it will be that after every interval of 1, the amplitude will be doubled. Or if you are going back, it will be halved. But it will happen for the same duration of one unit in sort of way. Right? This is the meaning. Also, moving forward, we are given that x is equal to 0 to 1, say, beach may. fx is equal to x into x minus 1, which is a very simple function, right? This is nothing but quadratic, which we can write as x square minus x, or in fact, even better that it is written like this. Why? Because we know the graph of this that it will be having zeros from 0 to 1. And more interestingly, the graph of fx is 0 to 1 only in the for this particular function to exist, right? Where where it is given, this is the thing which is given here. Right now you are saying for x belonging to minus infinity to m, find m such that fx is greater than or equal to minus 8 by 9. So we have to find those that value of m where we will eventually get fx is equal to minus 8 by 9. That is what is saying. So very simple question, not a very difficult question, but a very good tricky problem to understand the impact of first of all, this particular statement, what impact this particular statement would have on our question. Now we know this is fx when x lies from 0 to 1. So with the help of this, now we will try to trace the other half of the function. What do you mean by that, sir? How do we will trace the other half? So we'll try to draw the question, you know, the uh, other part of the graph that is, let's say if this is 0 to 1, right? Now I say 0 and 1. Now from 1 to 2, the graph will have a double magnitude. For similarly, for 2 to 3, the magnitude will still be doubled. Let's draw it with white line only. Now, this is what the question is saying, right? This is what the question is intentionally. So if you will notice, the minus 1 to 0 graph will again half. It will again half and so and so forth. The, you know, the amplitude will go on decreasing. Very interesting. And if you notice, if this was your x axis, bacho, right? If this was your x, x axis, so the graph is below x axis, right? The entire graph that we have is below x axis. Now our target is to find fx is equal to greater than or equal to uh, minus 8 by 9. Now we just have to check where minus 8 by 9 will lie. It will could lie here, it could lie here, it could lie here. And the intersection value we have to found. So this is the entire question, simple question, but a lot of students got stuck because of the complexity in the question. Now, for that, to make it simple, ki kaha lie karega, you should find out the lowermost value. So, the question is now very simple. You know that for this, the minimum will lie at minimum at x equal to 1 by 2. You can figure out the value that will be 1 by 4 minus 1 by 2. And if you will notice, this will be what? Nothing but minus 1 by 4. So, that means this particular point here is minus 1 by 4 at 1 by 2. So similarly, this particular point here will be nothing but what? 2 plus 1 by 2, you can say. Oh, sorry. My bad, guys. This is not here. We have figured out 1. Okay. Yeah. So this is this particular point. 1 by 2, comma minus 1 by 4. Now, you have doubled the amplitude. So what this would be? Just imagine what this would be. Now, let's say f of x plus 1 is equal to 2 times fx. Right, so what this value would be? Now this would be minus 1 by 2 and do not worry that 1 by 2 is greater than 1 by 4, it is negative. So negative may, 
the smaller the number the bigger, bigger it is so it minus 1 by 4 will be closer to the x, uh, x axis as compared to this particular point and this will be 3 by 2 so we have already reached till minus 1 by 2 but we want to reach to this particular point right so what this would be now guys this will be 5 by 2 comma this will be what again minus 1 right we have doubled so that means that means our line that we were looking forward that we should intersect that is minus 8 by 9 right this is where somewhere here minus 8 by 9 will be there and we just need to find out that x where that x would be so this point of intersection will give you your value of x or the value of m i should rather then write this as m this will point will give you m now you know that this what is this curve you also know this right so we have this particular graph here right guys so we know what this graph is what is the uh, function value so fx was earlier x into x minus 1 we then moved here it got doubled and we then moved here it again got doubled so that means four times x into x minus 1 so effectively what you are guys are going to solve at the end is four times sorry uh, this is four times x into x minus 1 is equal to minus 8 by 9 this is what you are solving and you are looking for an answer which lies between uh, 2 and 3 okay wait 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 guys that is the biggest blunder and that is why this question i suppose went viral for gao Kao because this is wrong now just think why this is wrong we said that we did shifting right we did transformation of the graph along the x-axis in the right direction so what we guys have effectively done is i must write this as well transformation along x-axis that's what we guys have done and we have shifted this graph that is our original graph by how many units to the right that is we have shifted our original graph two units to the right so that means in the original question wherever we had x we'll have to replace x by x minus 2 that is why shifting will happen and the amplitude is going to get double and double that is quadrupled that is multiplied by 4 so this would not be the correct equation let me remove this so that you guys have space to calculate this now the correct answer would be 4 into x minus 2 x minus 3 is equal to minus 8 by 9 this is what we guys would have to solve for finding our answer right the question lies up to you that how you guys are going to solve this you will get obviously get two particular answers for this one would be this and one would be this particular value let's say we have to figure out minus infinity to m which also gives us that you have to find the first possible value first possible or you can say the smallest minus infinity to m had it been that they would have not mentioned minus infinity to m this would still lead to another confusion that there were two values which will satisfy this particular criteria but since it is minus infinity to m so that means solve this you'll get two particular values on which this is going to happen that is 7 by 3 and 8 by 3 so what would be your value of m that will be 7 by 3 this is going to be your final answer to this beautiful question which has a lot of excitement and now you know why the excitement was there okay guys this is your problem homework problem for which we'll be covering in the next window next video so let's see how many of you guys can solve this and let me know in the comment section what is the answer